Hey there, I'm Evan, and today we're gonna to talk about why it might be wise to take probiotics along with your antibiotics. I'm also gonna tell you the exact probiotics that I personally use if I ever have to take antibiotics. But first, let's explore the science behind why exactly probiotics can help you when you're taking antibiotics. In 2012, researchers published a study showing that if you take probiotics along with your antibiotics, you have about a 42% reduced risk of antibiotic-associated diarrhea. Normally, you know, a little diarrhea when you're taking antibiotics is not a big deal compared to the infection that the antibiotics could be knocking out. But one bacteria that can take over your intestines during a course of antibiotics is C. diff. C. diff is extremely resistant to antibiotics. It can overgrow your intestines and it can proliferate extremely quickly. It'd be one thing if you just got this infection while you're taking antibiotics, but it can actually last much longer than your antibiotic course. And in some extreme cases, it can even be life-threatening. And this is just one example of the sort of bacteria that can start growing in your intestines as a result of the antibiotics knocking out your natural or probiotic bacteria. The benefit of taking probiotics with antibiotics is you can prevent nasty antibiotic-associated diarrhea. All right, so in this first image, you can see how a healthy gut should look. You can see that row of healthy bacteria. There's no space for those bad bacteria to grow along your intestinal wall because you have those good bacteria blocking them out. Now, the second image shows that when you take antibiotics, you're actually gonna knock out a number of those probiotics you naturally have living in your intestines. Those probiotics can no longer offer the same protection. And so there's certain bacteria that are actually resistant to antibiotics, things like C. diff, and those bad bacteria can opportunistically jump onto your intestinal wall and they can start to proliferate there. But the idea is if you start supplementing with probiotics during your antibiotic course, well then those probiotics that you supplemented, they can kind of fill in there until your normal probiotics grow back. Now you're probably curious, what is the best probiotic to take along with antibiotics? The science is clear that there's value in taking probiotics along with your antibiotics. What's less clear is what is the best single strain or single combination of probiotics to take with antibiotics. There's good evidence that some bifidobacterium, some lactobacillus, some saccharomyces, as well as some uh, bacillus ones. What I do is I take a combination of all of those. So I really like to take Symbiotic 365. That's what I took with my recent antibiotic course to fix my finger. I really like this one. This has 14 different strains. It has Saccharomyces boulardii, which is completely resistant to most antibiotics. And that's because Saccharomyces boulardii is a yeast. Yeasts don't get affected by antibiotics because antibiotics are targeting bacteria. So fun little fact. This also has Bacillus subtilis, and that one is also resistant to antibiotics. The science also shows that taking human strains that are targeted by antibiotics, those still help even with an antibiotic course. As a rule, I'll take this a couple hours, typically about four hours after I take an antibiotic pill, I will take Symbiotic 365. I have that sort of spacing because it gives the probiotics a little bit better of a chance to survive against the antibiotics because hopefully the levels have reduced a little bit by then. As I take each, each antibiotic, I will also take a Saccharomyces boulardii, just that one strain alone. I'll take that along with my antibiotics. And the reason I'll, I can take them together because again, Saccharomyces boulardii, that's a yeast. Yeasts aren't affected by antibiotics. So I'll take that strain alone. And then a couple hours later, I'll take Symbiotic 365. I really like that combination. I stayed very regular, no diarrhea or anything. I didn't even notice any disruption in my uh, BMs during this week-long course of antibiotics. So I was pretty excited about that. Now in the upper right-hand corner, you can see a little eye with a circle around it. Now, if you click on that, you'll get access to my Symbiotic 365 review video. So you can check that out if you like, or you can go to probax.org and find the review. All right. now. I talked about why taking probiotics with antibiotics seems to be a very wise choice. And uh, like I said, it worked really well for me during this last round. But 
there's another product that I also recommend during an antibiotic course. And that's called Gut Connect 365. And the reason I like that one is because antibiotics have been shown to cause something called leaky gut, which, which is intestinal permeability. So basically in your intestines, you have a bunch of cells and hopefully they're, they're nice and tightly interlocked. But when you take antibiotics, well, these start to open up and things like bacteria can start to get in, into your bloodstream in places where they shouldn't be. So this can be problematic and it can cause inflammation. It's been linked to allergies. Either way, you wanna keep things nice and tight. So Gut Connect 365, I really like this because I can take this anytime with antibiotics, has no probiotics in there, and it has amino acids that help rebuild your intestines, as well as some soothing plant extracts that have some research behind them that show that they help repair intestinal permeability. And I like the way it tastes. I like the research behind it. And uh, if you look in the upper right-hand corner, again, there's that little circle with the eye in the middle. You click on that and you'll also get access to the Gut Connect 365 review video that I did. So if you have any questions, please ask in the comments of this YouTube video. Give me a like if you like this video. And of course, hit the subscribe button if you want to see more. We have some great weight loss videos coming up. We also have some secret stuff that I can't quite tell you about yet. But uh, I think you're going to really enjoy it. So I don't want you to miss out. So go ahead and hit the subscribe button. That's all for today. I'm Evan with probiotics.org. And I hope you really enjoyed this video.